This video is to show you the vibration plate, actually plates, that I have been using for a couple of years. Now why I have two of them side by side is a, a long story and I'm about to give one of them away, but before I do, I want to take the opportunity to show you side by side the comparison of these two vibration plates because they're very different. One um, is much more powerful than the other. The larger of the two is the first vibration plate I got and it I've had that since the end of 2019 when I got a gift card for um, and I used it for Amazon so I could buy the vibration plate because I really wanted one. So that's what I used my gift card money on was the vibration plate. And then in 2021, when I was spending an extended time in California with one of our adult children, I missed my vibration plate. So I looked online on Amazon and I chose a less expensive one, which that's the irony of this whole thing. The larger one is more expensive, less powerful. The smaller one is less expensive and more powerful. So I'm about to show you the difference in the two vibration plates. I will start with the larger one and then I'll move over to the smaller one and you'll be able to see the difference visually, I think, just from my cranking it up to full speed on both of them. All right, so I'm standing on the original vibration plate that I got as a Christmas gift because of a gift card in 2019. And I use this thing every morning for about 15 minutes. Sometimes I use it for 30 minutes because I find it so relaxing to me. And there's many health benefits that I'm going for. I will put information in the description box with research links. And you can read up on those yourself. Right now I'm just demoing the difference between the two machines to you. I'm going to turn this one on. And I'm going to... Crank it up to the full speed, which is 120. Almost there. All right, so this is the 120 speed. And I enjoy standing here. Some people exercise on them, I don't. I just, I stand. So. This is how this one runs. I think you're immediately gonna see the difference when I move over to the smaller one that costs less money than this one. I'm gonna turn this one off and it just stops. Okay, now I will switch over to my brand new one and get standing on this one and turn it on, whoops. Wait a minute, what's going on here? There we go. Well, they're very similar com uh, controllers, so I'm not surprised that reacted, but I don't think that's gonna crank up in speed. I'm gonna start the speed going up. Okay. Now right here, without even raising the speed, I just turned it on. This feels like the speed, rate of speed, and the amount of jiggling as that one feels. Now I'm gonna crank it up top speed, which is up to 180. I'll tell you when I hit 120. Actually, I'll stop at 120 for just a second when I get there. Still going. A little bit more. Okay, I'm at 120 now. This is much more powerful than that one. 120 for both of them. Now I'm going up to 180. You probably hear this in my voice. All right, almost there. Okay, this is 180. Now not only is it faster, um, but I actually have to hold my balance here. You might see that I'm wobbling a little bit which is kind of a good thing. It means that I'm having to use my core. I didn't have to do that with that one. 
Now, I have loved using that one since 2019. But this is the one I really love. And this is the same model I have in California at our daughter's home. And I'll be going there next week to enjoy it. She sent me this one. So I just love this thing and I could stay on here, but I'm doing a video. So let me stop. And instead of stopping suddenly, like that one does, it goes down bit by bit. Okay, and it powers off too. This one, the power is still sitting on. So those are the two vibration plates. The small one is the less expensive, more powerful one. The large one is the more expensive, less powerful one. They come with the same equipment. Um, they both have these hand straps, so you could, you know, do exercises on here. They they clip onto the side. There's a there's hooks, hooks underneath on each side of one. I've never used them. I don't like exercising. I really don't. So my exercise life right now consists of miles and miles of walking on my tread desk and using the vibration plate for relaxation and for lymph node drainage and such. So when I put this video up, it will be loaded with information in it to explain the health benefits that I'm going for that I've read about. It will have links in it for you to be able to use if you want to follow the research that I have done. I'll put a link into each model so that you can see for yourself the price differences. And um, that's it. I will be donating the large one to whatever friend seems to be interested in it. I'm going to be putting some uh, out some notices to a couple local friends to see if they would like to have it. It is better than... I, I was using it happily for a couple of years and there's nothing wrong with it. But now that I have the more powerful one, and it was a gift from our daughter because she knows how much I like the powerful one. I made an offhand comment that I was looking forward to coming to use my vibration plate at her place. So she sent me one for here for when I get back after my visit to California. Anyway, I think that's all I have to share with you about vibration plates. Thank you for listening.